Hey guys, welcome back to the Fox Pack. I'm sorry that me and Regan haven't been posting a lot because our life has been really busy. So today's topic of the video is going to be about you guys meeting my pet rat. And a few things you guys should know before I bring up my rat is a lot of rumors go around like rats are dirty, rats bite. Um, I'm going to answer some questions that people may have. Um, one, rats clean themselves and are rats dirty? No, rats are not dirty. They clean themselves like three times a day max. And if you hear stuff in the background, that is my family being very noisy. So I apologize, but rats are not dirty. They are clean and I give my rat a bath like every other week so she is definitely not dirty next is rats bite i'm not gonna say every single rat in the world does not bite but if you actually get to know them and the more you pick them up the more they will get friendly with you um and adjust to you better so my rat is um fully adjusted to me and she loves me and like i think we have a real good connection so let's get to getting the rat and i will see you when i have her okay guys i'm back and here is my pet rat this is chloe and i think you guys can tell by her name it is a girl she is the most loving thing ever and she looks like she has this gray on her head. And then she has like white everywhere. But then she has like a lot of strips down her back that are gray. And Chloe is really snuggly. And she's more of my like snuggly rat I've ever had. And um, she's just the love this kind of thing and if you hear the cat in the background that's because I have more than one pet and so if you hear the cats that's my cat but this is Chloe and you guys are probably wondering when I said cats and rats uh, the cats do not um, try to attack the rat because for some reason they just some of the cats think it's interesting there's only probably one cat that may be in, a little bit interested too much in her, but the other ones are really good with it. So this is her, and she's trying to move around a lot for some reason. Usually she's way calmer. She's just hyper because I took her out. This is only the second time I took her out today. So, Or the third, I mean, the third or the second time I took her out today. So that is why she's so hyper, and now she's going to hide. And do her thing. If you guys would like me to make a rat cage tour, I would love to do that. But this is Chloe, and she is the best thing ever. So, and if you guys want to know how many rats I've had before, I've had um, Chloe and her um, sister that recently passed away. Um, were my two first rats so she's one of my first rats and her sister recently passed so that's sad um she didn't live the fullest life because she had a tumor and it was hard to stop they we brought her to the vet and if you guys hear that that's Regan but we took her to the vet and um they said that like, they'll give her medication if she wasn't feeling better by the next day, um, that we would have to put her down. But, um, we went because it was almost, it was time to go to school, so I said my last goodbyes, and, unfortunately, um, we found her dead, so, um, it's really upsetting, but we moved the cage up stairs so Chloe would be with me, and... We just pay so much attention to her and make sure she has everything she needs to be able to be happy. So, this is Chloe. If you guys have any requests, then 
make sure to put it in the comments below. Subscribe to be a part of the Fox Pack. And hit the notification bell so you know anytime we actually post a video. Because me and Regan have to get back on track with doing that. And you guys, now I will not be um, posting on Sundays because on Sundays is my dance class at starting this week so that is why we are not going to be posting on Sundays or Wednesdays but I will see you guys in our next video bye guys